Hello, I am back. Now we don't have a game. Give me a second. But we have the audio from the game. Oh, is that a desk you can put in your house? I don't think that those are things that you can put in your house. Uh, you can get the little orange flag and you can hold it. Um, yeah, and it's got a soundscape too if you can hear it. It's got like someone on a loudspeaker in the background. There's an airplane sound that just went by. Like the ding dong that happens. It's very much like the atmosphere if you're in an airport, which is kind of fun. Well, let's actually add this silly video back in. Okay. And it's super tiny. All right, we have a game. Yay, now you guys can see the game even better. All right. So yes, we are sitting in an airport. Hello, good morning. We're so excited to have you here. Yes, yes. I am so excited to sign up for this adventure, guys. Yes. <laughs> Deserted island, get away. Yeah, that's that's exactly what sounds wonderful right now. Um, the really like kind of staying in my house all the time kind of is about the same feeling. The speaking sound is in stereo. That's weird. Let's try this. Now it's back. Now the speaking sound is back. Okay. Yay, we're learning so many things or reviewing so many things about how uh, <laughs> streaming works. Yay! Yes! Definitely a long haul. This is a long term relationship. Um, the commitment is starting now. Is this your first time applying for one of our packages? No, but it's been a while, and maybe some of you it's your first time, so let's go ahead and see. But... <gasps> I'm moving! <laughs> oh, I guess that's when you're moving islands. Uh, so yes. So if you wanted to restart without deleting all your save data, maybe... Oh no! They say the letter as you type it. So cute! Okay, how do I confirm it's a plus sign? Yes, I am okay. It is adorable that like this game has that cornered. What do I feel like making my birthday? What is today? Confirm. Of course that's my birthday. 
Okay. Of course, I've definitely submitted an application ahead of time. <laughs> Picture. Oh yeah, character creation. Let's see. I think they just have like the normal hair colors to begin with. So yes, I would like to be this style. I am kind of pasty white. Uh, uh yes. But if I pick this one, I'll look like a grandma. Mm. Who do I feel like being today? This is like the biggest question. Oh, we don't have that many options yet. Yeah, let's do that. Oh man. This character has seen some things. They are going on this island getaway to get away from some things. Okay. I don't know. This is, they, they did give us lots of eye options, which is nice. Oh, I like those. Those are cute. That's kind of classy. Those ones are kind of a little funky because, like, your eyeballs become your skin color. That's cute. Oh, when you have bangs, it's kind of hard to see. You could be sleepy. That's how I feel right now. Or, like, you... This is, like, the... The third plane transfer you've taken after like traveling for 14 hours and just like kill me now. The lashes on the bottom are kind of an interesting look. And we'll probably go with that. Yeah, what color of eyes do we want? Have a little nose. Let's do a smile. We can do some blush. That's cute too. Okay. Yes, looking our best, the best that we can be when we are in an airport. Okay. why we're all here, right? Aww. Oh, yes. I think this is a, maybe a new thing for this game that was different from the other ones. I don't remember, but this is, this is kind of nice. Right? Witness protection program. That that's exactly why I'm here. <laughs> okay, yes, northern and southern hemisphere. Where do I live now? Uh, not North America. That's true, there are a lot of people that live somewhere other than North America. Good job. <laughs> I do live in Europe. I don't know what that's for. I mean, maybe they're collecting demographic info? I don't know. Oh, maybe it's just if kids don't know what the northern and southern hemisphere is. This sounds awesome to me so far, Nooklings. Thank you. Okay. 
goes, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, yeah, so it is if kids don't know what's going on. winter just looking outside at just all the snow snow piled up yes it is indeed winter here but that is kind of nice so if you're the type of person that like really misses the opposite season <laughs> this is a nice way to experience that <laughs> northern hemisphere let's go I kind of like it Especially, like, this game has been really... Well, it came out at the beginning of, like, Corona times. And for the first summer after it was out, I didn't really have a lot of work to do. Or, like, spring-summer. Um, and so... It has been um, kind of a nice way to connect with the out... Like... Seeing the seasons in this, even though I'm not going outside so much, has been kind of nice. Also, I don't know. I just kind of live vicariously through my character, my avatar in this a little bit. And I'm like, okay, what would be my perfect wardrobe if I had a million monies and all the room in my closet for, like, a winter day like this? <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's all quite natural. What does that mean? Really? <laughs> Organically grown islands. Yep. Yay! Okay, so... first start out you only have the dark access to the dark green areas and the beach um, also you don't have a way to cross the river yet so how do we want to do this kind of fun with the second layer sticking out so far. What do you think, Othwile? Oh yeah, the airport next to the plaza would be nice. Well, I mean, they're... Yeah, so like... The ones on this side have it kind of close. Okay, so no matter how it is, you can't get to the dock first off, Be or right away. They've got that kind of blocked off by, um, what are these? Rivers. They're called rivers. Yep. This one looks kind of cool. Like, I like having, like, I don't know. Bottom right. Very symmetrical. <gasps> oh man, but this has a heart lake. We might need to go with a heart lake. And I don't know. I kind of like the little more awkward shapes of these two. Like this one also is really calling to me. This one's funky. It's gonna be kind of cramped to start with. Maybe 
Maybe I can stick someone on the beach. That could be fun. Oh, decisions, decisions. I can make a heart like. I can do that myself. Oh, don't make me reconsider. Okay, we'll do it. This is only a life affecting choice until we get terraforming, which is gonna be. Uh, it depends on how much I get done. We'll see. Okay. <laughs> I can't wait to see it, guys. Thanks. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh... A lamp. A sleeping bag. Seems I'm a pretty practical person. That seems practical. To kill the time. Something to murder God with. Uh, we'll do a sleeping bag. Interesting. What does this tell us about your personality and how you will behave as an island representative? Don't know. <laughs> I like this. this is true. That I like to sleep with like a little bit of comfort. Of course she'll cover all my basic needs. Here we go! <coughs> okay, so we're gonna get two random villagers with us the first time, which is... Er, when we go, so I'm excited. Let's see what this is. Perfect timing! So great, it's like such a corporate promotional video. <laughs> <clears throat> and it's definitely something that would happen on a flight. Ooh, here it is! This is our first look! Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, wow. Well, look at all this work that needs to be done. <clears throat> oh, there's no sound. It is super cold out here, Mr. Nook. I am not wearing very many clothes for it to be this cold. Who are you? Can I talk to you? No? Oh, do I have to get in this spot? Okay, I'm ready. Yes? How do I trigger this? Ah, I have to push. I have to push a button. Your outfit is terrible, but we can fix that. natural to me. <coughs> A package deal. <coughs> they do quick work too, like overnight. <laughs> Okay. Hello, may I please have a tent? You get a scarf. My very own tent is so excited. <coughs> Okay, now we have the next giant decision in our life. Yeah, map would be nice. Thank you. Yes, you're the best, Timmy. I'm gonna find the best spot. Okay, where do we want to be? Hello, who are you? You have silver on your feet. <coughs> you did. <coughs> I wonder, I haven't, I don't remember what she is off the top of my head, but she seems like she might be peppy. We'll see. <coughs> We will be neighbors for a while at least. Look at this cool place, so many rocks. Can I set my tent up on the rocks? Oh, sad. Got this cool little peninsula thing. Which is kind of in the same spot from our last island, which is gonna be weird. Oh, we have peaches! Hothwile, we have peaches on this island. You're welcome. I didn't even think to check it. Snow sounds. There's a cricket in the ground somewhere. You have to dig them up. We also don't have a way to cut down trees yet, so... Oh, hello! 
Hello, boots. Wow. Oh, he might be a lazy villager. That would be fun. <clears throat> Oh no, he's Jock. Well, you're the first one to get switched out. Your body and your soul. Okay, dude. Can I see? I can't see it right now. Yes, that's true. Stick my thing. So I'm probably going to want to put the shops on either side of the plaza. sort of riverside house. Uh, will that take away the trees? Right. It will. Okay, we don't want to do that. So let's move it over just a little bit. <coughs> But I do want there to be enough room to be able to do like something along the side next to the water. right there. Yeah, let's do it. I have a tent. It's gonna be really cold. <laughs> so glad I asked to bring an extra sleeping bag. <laughs> Yay! Can I go inside the tent? suitable spot for my tent. It's very pretty. Okay, yeah, so this is how they're the let you as part of without metagaming it too much, they let you place villager stuff, which is nice because I've heard in previous games that they just kind of go wherever they want. <laughs> <laughs> the, which is an interesting creative exercise, but if they just like plop down in the middle of something you've been planning, it's kind of annoying. Ama, can you hear the little sparkly sounds they have when you get close to snowflakes? Oh, wait, where's another one? You've changed how I experience games a little bit because now I'm like extra sensitive to the sound cues. <laughs> okay, BB, you seem like somebody who'd want a beach beach pad. Where did you go? Hello. I did. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> I love her. This is a problem. Because I'm not sure if she's gonna match like my end aesthetic. I'm I'm thinking about going for either uh, like totally committing to a full goth theme island or space. Let's see, or cats, or cats. I mean, I could do goth cats. 
seems like an aesthetic. I don't know, we'll see. <clears throat> Oh no, maybe she's like the sisterly type because this sounds kind of, the dialogue sounds familiar from Canberra, who I had on the first island, who was sisterly. <laughs> I would love to pick the perfect spot for you. <laughs> she is really pretty. I like the colors on her. Yeah. You go do all this work for me. I'm not even going to check on it. I'm sure it'll be fine. I just met you, but I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm gonna give you a beach house. Yeah, girl. Okay. <coughs> Everybody's dead. Right? It's still. Yay! Phoebe got it. this is gonna be cute to like put little like beach stuff out front of it for her. Alright, boots. Where am I gonna put you, my dude? Leaving Sika. No, I need to do this. He's here for a while. Where did he go? Maybe I've made your house. I did. I did. You are obviously the favorite villager right now. <clears throat> the sweetest. I'm gonna go look for it. Yep, he sure does look like a real mess. Oh, that's true, Hothwile, because they move into the same plot. No, you should not be my direct neighbor. I do not want to be downwind from the sweat stink. Mm -mm. I will find you a spot, my dude. Well, you can come to I will. Well, we to I sure am. <laughs> <laughs> it will be epically far away from me. <laughs> You do that instead of doing the hard work it takes to make it a reality. Okay, I mean, chalk villagers are not my favorite. Uh, I did have one on my last island, but he was kind of an exception to the rule because it was it was Hammy, who is a hamster, and the concept of a jock hamster that just wanted to do a lot of cardio was hilarious to me because I have had rodents before and just like hamster running on a wheel. <laughs> it was just the funniest image to me and I was like, also he's like this tall. <laughs> so I was like, okay, yeah, you can be my island bro. That's fine. <laughs> Love him. 
So great. about doing a lighthouse in the peninsula, which would be fun. So then I can make a lighthouse keeper. Sure, let's do that. <clears throat> yeah, everybody's got a spot. And it like yeets you back. It's like, nope, we, you will progress the story. It's a great spot. The best spot. <clears throat> yeah, but he's gonna make you pay to move them, and you don't have a lot of monies to start with. More serious business. Yay. Oh, thank God, it's so fucking cold out here. Of course. Teamwork. This is going to set the tone for the rest of our adventure together. Ooh, a snack. Come to my office. What did I do? You suspect they're real peaches. Buy weeds for me, guys. I don't know what they do with them, but sure. It's gonna be epic, I'm sure. Tommy, you look like you have a problem. Timmy, I mean. Okay. Timmy, what are you doing? Looks like you got plenty of firewood. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's find some tree branches. One. <gasps> Two. Weed dealers. You know what? <laughs> Three. <laughs> This is the correct type of weed for that, but sure. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Here we go. All right, Mr. Nook, I have acquired some things. So many tree branches on this island. Please take them from me. He's so happy. They're so cute. Oh, he's like, I'm gonna exploit the crap out of this person. <laughs> Hey, no, I thought you were going to help with this. <laughs> okay. stuff direct 
basically where like things will fall and then like bounce one square so if there isn't a spot for it to bounce it'll just disappear. Okay we got ourselves six, six peaches. Alright we got ourselves some snacks. <laughs> to the challenge. I know what I want to call this, but I love seeing what the... Whoop, can I actually put a... Be grammatically correct in this. I want to name it Sophie's World, but there might be too many. War. Hmm. Call it Isla de Sophie. That might be too many also. All right, what are some... Called Sophie Town. This is gonna sound like a theme park. Other, what are some 
like the parts at the end of the word that like towns that mean like water or weird or just town because there's so few so ton is just like short for town and then Berg is also kind of a town thing. I don't know if I can do Berg, that might be too long. Oh no, it's not. Would it be... I don't know if it's like... <laughs> That's funny because like... It kind of sounds like first. <laughs> and then... Oh, I could. That would just be weird. There we go. Okay, so we could put like an S in there. Uh, I want to make that it. Yeah, like that. Camel case it. That looks funky, but we made it work, guys. We made it work. Confirm! Which one is the confirm button? Uh, the monitor I'm playing with this on is like s slightly narrow. <laughs> so it's like cutting off the edges. But I can see it on this. Like this. Confirm! Yeah. We are ready. I want to hear everyone's. Okay, we gotta be, we gotta be quick. Rocks a lot, Buffberg. Nice. Sophie seems to have the enthusiasm and the naming sensibilities. Wow. see them. be funny if it was just random stuff and then you could actually pick it. That would be kind of cool. We don't even have to deal with the other options. Okay. made one decision and now we're gonna rely on you for everything because you seem capable <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, no 
want the sassy choice to just like, hey, or like, yeah, I'm literally as responsible as you all think I am. I am responsible. I'm gonna make lots of decisions for all of you. Yeah. <laughs> What are we toasting with? We need shakes. Or smoothies. Peach smoothies. I love that we all take it out of our pocket. It's like, yeah, I keep my smoothie cocktail in my pocket. No big deal. I did! It's like I do all the work around here. A toast! Yay! that's really fun with the soundscape or how they've done sound in this game is um, you have different things that will play um, uh, or different uh, audio devices in the game so like this is a I don't know a boombox I guess um, and you can have like a stereo system and a record player and stuff like that and they each have a different sound quality to them um, and also it's directional right here when you're out in the open you can't uh, like rotate yourself or the direction of it too much well maybe I, I could but I probably can't with that um, yeah I can't do anything with it uh, but it will also change how it sounds depending on how you're facing like which way it's facing. I don't. But even with this moving around it, it has it in stereo in the headphones, which is kind of fun. But yeah, right now it's not uh, synced with. The game isn't going with. So when you were in the plaza, it's that, but then if you come out here, then it switches to another music. I don't remember which time this is, but here in a little bit, it'll be synced up. The game will be synced up with the actual time of day that it is here. Um, but it's got a little bit of like a little bit of stuff in the beginning. That Specific time stuff like having this be nighttime. Okay, yes, lovely island. Talk to everybody. Let's go see what's in our tent. Yes, camping car. Yeah, 
Yeah, I've done so much hard work. I probably jet lagged to hell and back. Let's go check out a new house. Yeah. <gasps> Hello, Sentinel Phoenix. It's so exciting to see you. I'm so amazed that we're like actually like oh oh like like up at the same time. <laughs> But yeah, I'm restarting my Animal Crossing island. And I'm going to be streaming Animal Crossing Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. This time, starting from like an hour ago for two hour chunks. Um, because yeah, I was going to play it anyways. <laughs> so might as well do it on here. Um, but yeah, so much new content came out for Animal Crossing last fall and I hadn't played for quite a while that I was like oh my gosh there's just so much new stuff and I had so many new ideas but at the same time I was like really kind of tied down to like what I had already had and then we started streaming project for my work and so then it was the gateway drug and so now I'm like okay well I know I want to spend time on this <laughs> so <laughs> I might as well Ooh, my goodness. What were you streaming? And what time is it over there? It's pretty late, yeah? Oh, yeah, I got a lantern. Oh, I like that color of radio. Oh, nice. That's fun. Can I turn it on yet? Ooh. Okay, there's only one radio station. 105. Oh, okay, that's not like horrible. What color did they give me? Ooh, I also like this. I got camo last time. I'm not a camo fan. But like a nice neutral color there that I can But yeah, the sound quality changes when you move it. Yeah, go to bed. It's it is late over there. But that's kind of exciting to know that, like, maybe I might catch you before I start my streams in the morning. So, like, while I'm eating breakfast. Mm, we'll see, we'll see. I'll keep an eye out for you. Bye! Alright. We have three whole pieces of furniture, crew. And that's what we got, so... I have no blankets, but we're gonna sleep on this in the frozen tundra that we live in. Yeah, let's do it. Let us sleep. Mm, Friday through Tuesday. Oh yeah, you do weekends. Nice. Guys, it's foreshadowing. Why, yes, random doggo in my dreams. Thank you, dream doggo. It was. It was made for exploring. Such a, such a great feeling. But sir, are you aware that you are not a cat? <laughs> oh, you have a... F what do... Mm, yes. Swedish friend would definitely be in a similar time zone as me. I'm not sure if they're in the exact same time or not as Finland. But yeah, you'll have to tell me who they are. Who 
who's been stuck inside there for two years. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, being by your lonesome can grind on the soul. This is a game about friendship. If you hadn't, if you didn't know that yet. <laughs> Oh. Get you some pals, says Dream Doggo. All right. Oh yeah, the world is made for exploring. As I've been stuck in the house for two years. Though to be fair, I did a good, a good chunk of exploring in the last decade. It's been kind of nice actually to be stuck in the house. It's been nice to like, um put down to kind of instead of oh sentinel phoenix you're hosting my stream thank you we'll see if anybody's up on your side of the world <laughs> you're the best i love you <laughs> uh but yeah it's been kind of nice to like instead of <laughs> you never know maybe someone will be up it's true, it's true. Twitchland is a weird space. <laughs> uh -oh. I don't even remember what I was saying. Anyways, yes, we need we need some friends. Are you scolding me, KK, about how I looked at Boots and said, No way, dude, you're moving out? <laughs> you need to be friends with Boots, Sophie. You need to be friends with everyone. <laughs> It's true. I mean, you're a dream doggo. What, whatever, you can you can ramble. <laughs> breaking some. All right, that's breaking the fourth wall in this dream. All right. Don't forget to make friends, man. Aww. Sharing it with friends, yay. It does. Good, <laughs> Thank you for giving me the name of their channel. Gonna save that for later and look them up. Sophie, wake up! Oh man, can you imagine your landlord after you're like super jet lagged is just like scratching on the wall of your tent to be like, Hello! Good morning! <laughs> this is the quickest way to end up with a unsolvable island murder. In the first two days. Just saying. I do not wish to awake, yet here we are. Hmm. 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 Okay. It's 8 o'clock in the funky morning, but fine. Oh, I guess, no, I guess it's 11.15, so this is, this is a fair, a fair thing for somebody to be like, hello, are you gonna get up ever? <clears throat> no, I don't want to get up, we're just gonna keep sleeping. So yeah, we got a, we got a tent. I wonder if I can hang things on the walls here. We'll find out. Good night. Good morning. It's time to face your dead. I did have a pleasant nap, also known as a full night's sleep, but thank you. It is a brand new day. Wow, I <laughs> did that, yes. <sighs> yes. Aww, okay. What is this? 
this. <laughs> you know what you need on a deserted island? A cell phone. <laughs> way to do a tutorial. Tell us about smartphones, Tom Nook. No, never. What is this? Shocking. <laughs> oh, you grew up in the bumpfuck nowhere. Great! This is just the island for you. Okay, so learn how to use it. Great, okay. An extra bonus, this is not going to come bite me in the butt later. For sure not. For sure not. Oh, this is new! I haven't seen this actually. Yeah, let's see what this is. Send me the app. Do it. Ooh. I don't know what it does. Maybe this is like a hints thing? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> now, now we have the crippling death. <laughs> I'll give you an app as a bonus. But here's your itemized pill. I want. How much you want to bet? <laughs> <laughs> that the app is like in line on the itemized <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna charge you for this phone I just gave you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. That's so much. And look how much money we have! We have like no money! <laughs> okay. Water bills! <laughs> Dude, you don't know what bells are, silly. What? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> They are money. This is true. I'm glad you have realized that I do not have any money to pay you back with all of these things. <laughs> It's true, this is totally a monop a capitalist monopoly by one man. Um, this is really kind of a dystopian game underneath all the cute. <laughs> also the being an adult simulator. <laughs> Hello 
children! Welcome to what it feels like to have a mortgage! <laughs> and debt. <laughs> okay, sure, we'll pay with Miles. That sounds like company script, but okay. <laughs> no mileage program. Wow, that sounds really nice. Because <laughs> they're selling your data for advertisers. <laughs> Just live your life and let us follow along with it. <laughs> or store credit card is like. Few other matters, as meaning I need to go inform the other two island residents of how much debt they have. Thank you for coming here! I'm so excited to take all of your money for the next many, many years. <laughs> Aww, thank you, Tom. best side because that's the side that my um, eyes are looking at. Ooh. All of these filters are not working well with having a snow background. Wow. Let's just do normal. What is that one? Oh, you can put a frame on. Sure, we can put a timestamp. A date down in the corner. Oh, like old <laughs> like 80s, 90s photos. Frame and date. Oh, that's cute. I think I want to do yeah, the frame plus date. Yeah, let's take this photo. I'm sad I don't have any poses yet. Okay, the most important thing when you first get a smartphone is to take a selfie. Nook Miles! That's where we were actually supposed to be going. <laughs> Yay! Earn Nook Miles for completing island activities. Alright. Earn the miles. Okay. What is this? You traveled a long way just to move to the, our little island and you enrolled in the Nook Mileage program so you earned your first miles! There are lots of ways to earn miles by just enjoying island life. Okay. 
Okay, how many do we get for that? 500! Okay, this one is... Fishing... And catching bugs. <laughs> Hello! Thank you for following, Swarland. <laughs> I know this is not your style of game, but... <laughs> I'm happy to entertain you this morning. Uh... Oh, so if you talk to all your neighbors, or a certain number of neighbors each day? Oh, uh, cute. This is definitely like a friendship simulator game. Do we have anything else? Uh, planting flowers. Picking fruit. Um, yeah, so at some point I'm going to have to get people with islands so I can go sell fruit there and we can go visit other people's islands, which would be kind of fun. Seashells to sell. <clears throat> mm hmm. Board. Wait, oh, wrong button. Play. Too much PlayStation, and I've got the button switched in my head. I've been doing so good so far. I've managed to do an hour and a half without messing up my Nintendo buttons in my brain. Okay, horde reward. Oh, I'm gonna get this. <laughs> well, actually, I don't know, because like the first time I played this game, I didn't realize that you could buy furniture that you'd already acquired like picked up um, so you could sell it and then buy it back from uh, like a catalog uh, I also didn't know that you could buy additional pieces of something you had so I just was like I have this sectional couch that's in blue but I I want the corner piece but I can't find it in any other color in the same color again so I could have like a blue and pink sectional couch <laughs> Oh well. Yeah, gonna buy all the furniture. I took a selfie, so we get miles for that apparently. Yeah! I'm a photogenic photographer, guys. Yeah, what else do we got? Edit credit? Oh yeah, we need to create the passport. Or passport? Um. Oh yeah. Bulletin boards. It's fun to go to when you go to other people's islands. I always like to go and um, like draw a little picture on their bulletin board. Okay, I think putting stuff out, items outside, was something that was a new feature with this game. Making a custom design. Okay, so we got lots of, and then of course a bazillion other things are gonna open up as we go along. This is a custom design thing. We're not going to do that now. We got a big map. So it shows you where people's houses are, which is nice when you're going to somebody else's island. So you know where things are at. Okay. Passport! Okay, let's edit this. Uh, passport photo's fine for now. I'm probably not gonna change it until I get uh, the other hair colors. Title. Ooh, I've got so many things. Photogenic. 
Island resident. Photogenic crossing. <laughs> Resident rest representative? No. <laughs> Deserted island, island dweller. Like Nook Inc.'s patron, because that's really what this is gonna be. I'm gonna give them so much money, and we'll get more options as we go along and we unlock more things. Comment. Go put my Twitch handle in here. Spell words, guys. No, oh, I think this is going to be too long. Oh, maybe not. It is so we could just do. See if we can put Twitch in there. I don't, it might be too long. Cause I'm gonna use this for other things. Is though. <sighs> yeah. Oh no. Okay. Done. actually had to use this. Nah, I'm fine. What is this? I have life on the one. Yeah, this is something new that has come in since I last played. <clears throat> no tips yet. Okay. Okay, we've unlocked some things. <clears throat> Edited my passport. Yeah! Only. Oh, 
say 5,000 miles, so 3,900 miles to go, guys. We got this. Is there anything more? I don't think so. Okay. And mail! Oh man, so many, just so many things already. <coughs> Congratulations! Aww. What are you? Present! Open! Aww. Oh wait, there was another thing. <coughs> what is that? I want to get some tables because everything is just on the floor and that's a little awkward. Oh, I can hang it on the wall. Oh, why? What? Oh, yeah, and they're gonna, they let you move through half spaces now, too, which is great. Okay, well, let's put you here. Okay, okay. Place it! I want to see what this is. Uh, I have a random photo of people I don't know. That's exciting. Just gonna stick that there, I guess. I don't think I can put you on the angle. Now it's just sideways. Now they can stare at me while I sleep. Uh, let's put our workbench here. <clears throat> oh no, it's to learn how to make it. Oh, I can't do that yet. Okay, fine. on the season. I like some better than others, but I like the winter ones. Oh god. Let's see what else we <coughs> Oh, you're so little. Hello. Oh, it's so nice to see you too, Tom. I guess it was. Oh man, 24 hours a day. Dudes, when do you sleep? Okay, 
to having a dash button. Welcome! I have such a neutral color palette in this town so far. Well, yeah, it's because it's like winter palette, so everything's <laughs> really white. It is cozy in here. Do you have a heater? <laughs> you must have a heater. <laughs> Jimmy about things. That's true. All the stuff I've been doing is like fiction and stuff. Wow. See, they're like, this is like a loss leader or like a sale item. It's like, we're gonna let you sell us twigs and branches. But that's because we know that you're actually going to bring us things of worth at some point. So we're just kind of helping, keeping you hooked, getting you used to the idea of working for us. <laughs> I see what you're doing, Tom. Oh, mm. Yeah, let's learn how to craft. Yes, I would like to do that. <coughs> Oh yeah, cardboard box and a tree branch. Cardboard boxes usually show up when you have like a new resident moving in. <coughs> What is this thing, Tom? It's an ATM because the first thing you need on a desert island, aside from a smartphone, okay, so the second thing you need is an ATM. Yay, can get stuff. And the Bank of Nook. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. See, capitalist dystopia. Mm hmm. Oh, cool. Welcome to the next stop. Oh, yeah, and you get miles for logging in. What do we got? Oh, yeah, this is very important to island life. Oh my gosh, I could get a hat. I like an actual knit hat. That would be slightly warmer than what I have. 
Glasses? Oh, I need glasses. My character feels wrong without glasses. More t-shirts. Shorts! That's definitely what I need this time of year. I think I have those shoes on right now. And music. Oh yeah, they have a whole bunch of Mario stuff. You could do a Mario themed island. These pipe things are kind of cool though because they're actually uh, teleport stuff. So when you get two of them, um, you can oh, wait, two, two. <laughs> uh, you go in one and it'll spit you out the other. And when you have like more than two, you go in one and it'll just randomly spit you out of one of the others. You don't get to choose. But if you have two, it's a nice way to get from like opposite ends of your island. Yeah. Is this just all Mario stuff? <gasps> nice. Yep, all Mario stuff. Oh! Oh yeah, we got all the Lunar New Year stuff. There's several Lunar New Year things and it will kind of cycle around. Oh, I wasn't here for actual Lunar New Year's Eve though, so I didn't get the the little statue thingy. Maybe I'll have to go back in time. Oh. Oh yeah, and then we've got Valentine's Day coming up. And the Super Bowl. <laughs> All right, so those are things that are there. <laughs> We have no money, so that's a pretty boring screen right now. Okay, let's learn about DIYs, and then that'll probably be halted for today. We'll start up tomorrow with some crafting. Hello. <laughs> about those moving fees. Okay. <laughs> Oh, yes, it's the next available session now. Yes. What is DIY? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, do you see in the back they've got a, a tea station and it's got like one big mug for Tom and two little mugs for the Nooklings. Oh, so cute. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, for free. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'd love to. Let's get started. <clears throat> Next available session is now. Yeah. Rod. <laughs> Yay. A little flimsy. Okay, five tree branches. Okay. I have one tree branch. Four more tree branches. One, two, three. Oh, neighbor. Neighbor that I actually like. Hello. <laughs> true, true, there's there's a lot of weeds here. <laughs> Yeah, I 
size they are, they kind of have sassy replies, which is, like, you can talk to them and they'll have, like, sassy replies for you. Uh, but to make a perfectly proportioned one, you need to do that in order to get items to craft things, seasonal items, but it's... The threshold for, like, the proportions is really... It's kind of tight, so I just... I was like, <laughs> after a week, a solid week of trying to get them, and just every single time I was like, nope! <laughs> I looked up guides, I was just, I'm just really bad at making snow boys, and it was very frustrating, <laughs> so I couldn't get, like, most of the winter items. It made me sad. Or at least the winter crafting items. I can still get lots of other things. Hello! I have tree branches now! I did! Yeah! Let's do a fishing rod. Let's do it! Yes! I would like to crack this. Yeah! It's quite simple. Aww, so nice of you. Send them to my phone. Oh yeah, now I can craft things. Yay. Bye, oh, yes. Aim in front of the shadow of a fish. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, we show Tom before we sh before we get the museum, dude. Let's craft. What else do I have that I can make? I can make a campfire. Okay, we're gonna make an. I need materials. Oh, I need more tree branches. I have more tree branches for that. Okay. But I think I had some. Yeah, I had some that I can learn. Let's learn the leaf umbrella. Yeah! I know a leaf umbrella. There was another one. The workbench. Yeah! What do these look like? So I need lots of tree branches. Yeah, I chatted with my residents. I get miles. I'm an unhindered wallflower. 
okay. Uh, and then it's make things. Make more tools, because they will break all the time. Uh, that was everything we needed. Yeah. What was in here? Just, you have DIY recipes. Recipes. to stop for the day unless there's This will still work. <laughs> you didn't, you just missed a bunch of setup. I'm um, awkward. Uh, so now we're like actually into the gameplay stuff, which is nice. I'm gonna take my last photo. Whoop, wrong button. do with this island. We're gonna have to see kind of how things progress. Oh, I can sell the stuff I have. We need tree branches. Oh, I think I just heard a balloon. I'm sad. Best of luck with the stingray today, Ama. It's gonna be... I hope everything goes well. Text me if you need anything. <laughs> yes, please take my stuff. or a smoker. Mm. Okay, and then I can get things like, oh yeah, I wanna buy those. Why would I buy a peach? I'm literally, okay. Well, maybe if I use them all up sort of thing. Can I sell things to you? Tra they're gonna pay me for trash. Yes, I would like you to buy things from me. Seashells. I'm gonna keep the stone for now. The fine things I brought in today. Holy 
Holy shit. That's a lot of bells. Sold. I do not understand what this currency is. Like, how it works. Okay, can I buy the recipes? Oh yeah, I totally can. Yeah, slingshot recipe. I want that. I would like to buy this. Oh, okay, what is this? Okay. That makes sense. Okay, there we go. all my money on recipes and flowers. <laughs> some stuff. Ooh, I'm a consumer, guys. <laughs> I sold things. I'm in an eventuality. Oh my gosh. Revitalizing the local economy. That's one way to put it. Just telling me I got a bunch of new recipes. Oh my gosh, we've got so many things that we can make tomorrow. Hey, I don't know if I want to make any of those things. Maybe the campfire. Definitely the bug net. We'll find out. Okay. But I don't have a way to get that yet. Or the clay. Oh, I can buy them from the shop. Okay, anyways, this has been lovely. I'm gonna go do some other things with my life, like some chores. And hopefully making a map for a tabletop scenario that I have been uh, working on for at least six to eight months. <laughs> Meaning, I've done a little bit of work and then I've just left it for six to eight months. <laughs> but I have a deadline now, we're playing it in two weeks, so I gotta actually do it. <laughs> there have been ideas, there have been some sketches, uh, but it's the like actual doing the work part of the thing. Uh, quite similar to the talk we had with Laura Kroger last night on the um, Out of Orbit game channel about creating LARP stuff. It's kind of similar with any creative project. You get to the point where you're like, uh, okay, I've got a concept. It's, it's fleshed out, but if I don't have an actual deadline, then the actual 
changing things from bullet points into actual full-fledged stuff is just it's just not gonna happen but I have a deadline now so so it's got to happen <laughs> so yes have a wonderful Thursday people and we'll see you tomorrow yeah